The Labour Party has raised alarm over the duplication of its presidential candidate, Peter Obi's identity. Obi was arrested and detained by British immigration officials when he landed at Heathrow Airport in London on charges of duplication of his identity. The Labour Party says the person impersonating Obi could commit crimes and it will be pinned on him. The Independent National Electoral Commission in River State has scheduled supplementary elections for Unit 5, 10, 18 in Port Harcourt Constituency 2 and Unit 4, 7 and 42 in Kana Gokana Federal Constituency on Saturday, April 15, 2023. Resident Electoral Commissioner for River State Johnson Sinikem announced this in Port Harcourt. Nobel laureate Professor Wole Shohinka has described comments by Labour Party's vice presidential candidate Yusuf Dati Baba Hamid on the swearing in of President elect Bola Tinibu as reckless, fascist, menacing, and unacceptable for a person of his caliber. The Nigerian police force has arrested the three policemen who assaulted a traveler at Elibrada Junction along the east-west road in River State. First Public Relations Officer CSP Ulumu Yiwa Adejobi, who said their trial would begin soon, identified the culprit as Inspector Adejo Siaka, Inspector Friday Obaka, and Sergeant Winda Kwebari, all from River State. The Nigerian government, in partnership with Google Incorporated, has announced that loan apps will no longer have access to their users' contacts or photos from May 31, 2023. The government said this was to prevent loan app firms from invading customers' privacy. The Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Commission said it has registered 170 loan apps out of the 200 operating in Nigeria. The National Association of Resident Doctors has opposed the House of Representatives bill mandating Nigerian trained medical and dental practitioners to practice for five years before being granted a full license. In a communique issued after an emergency meeting of its National Officers Committee, the doctors expressed their grievances and disappointment at the attempt by the government to enslave Nigerian doctors. The management of Friesland Kapina Wamco Nigerian PLC, manufacturers of pig milk, has approved apologize to the Christian Association of Nigeria over a viral video ad used to promote their brand, which Khan found very offensive, saying the video has been withdrawn. In the video ad, the crucifixion of Jesus Christ was used as a metaphor to promote their product on Good Friday. The Ocean State Police Command said it had arrested two persons in connection with the murder of a 500-level student of Obafemi Awolowo University, Ileife, Okoli Ahinze. Ahinze was mobbed to death by fellow students inside the AO Hall of Residence of the OAU campus on Monday over a missing phone. Meanwhile, OAU Vice Chancellor Professor Adebayo Bamire says the committee has been set to probe the circumstances surrounding the Ahinze's death. Renowned novelist Chimamanda Adichie has disagreed with Nobel laureate Professor Wole Shoinka over his comments on Labour Party's vice presidential candidate Dati Baba Ahmed. Adichie stated that Shoinka's description of Baba Ahmed's comments as fascist was a strong word and not appropriate for the situation. Professor Shoinka has described Ahmed Dati's comment on swearing in of Bola Tinubu as reckless and fascist. The Nigerian police force has dismissed three of its men for misuse of firearms in their possession while on escort duty with a musician in Kano. Police spokesman Muiwa Adejobi said the decision followed investigation into complaints and video evidence against their conduct and the outcome of an orderly room trial of the affected policemen by the first provost marshal.